Now, let's have a little quick chat about your uh, excellent book, Discipline Without Damage, how to get your kids to behave without messing them up, because seriously, that's such such a really big concern of parents. Um, and it is going to be the topic you're, you're chatting about at our conference. So, um, you know, without giving too much away, can you tell me what we might expect from your from your seminar session that we've got coming up? Yeah, so one of the biggest pitfalls that we can kind of find ourselves um, uh, tumbling into as parents is that we get lost in the form of it all. We want our children to behave a certain way because we think that they need to learn all of these lessons in order to succeed in this life that we're living and it reflects very badly upon us when they're not falling into line with all of this. And so we we get um, sort of bogged down in thinking that really being good parents and doing discipline well is about seeing good behavior. And yet when we go into sort of the developing brain and we understand that by default children have um, immature brains. They aren't adults and so they have to go through development. It's going to lead to them being dysregulated and needing our support in um, helping them through. Uh, well, we can really connect with all of that. What we will realize very quickly is that most of the ways that we have been taught to discipline our children, things like timeouts and consequencing them and removing privileges and all of that kind of stuff, actually um, are a sacrificial play. You are, are perhaps momentarily landing on good behavior, but you've arrived at that outcome at a cost. And the cost has been that you've put the very thing most essential to healthy development, which is your children's relational connection back to you, on the line. And for what? For good behavior. The reality is you will grow a child capable of self-control, capable of managing their impulses, capable of making great choices when you connect with them and flow in alongside them and support them through the challenging moments of life. It grows them really amazing brains and beyond that really incredible souls.